asking from people for help once and twice and several times does not contradict the concept of tawakkul. Does not contradict the concept of tawakkul. Allah the Almighty says in Surah An-Nisa, "Man yashfa' shafa'atan hasanatan yakul lahu nasibun minha." Whoever intercedes for a good cause, he will be rewarded, will have a share of the reward. A man came to the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, asking for financial help, and he didn't have any for a ride. He said, "But go to so and so." He went, and the man happily supported the beggar or the person who was in need. So the Prophet ﷺ remarked saying that أَدَّالُ عَلَى الْخَيْرِ كَفَاعِلِهِ or لَهُ أَدْرُ فَاعِلِهِ Whoever shows people goodness or kindness and they act upon it, they will be rewarded and he will have a similar reward. So asking help from people does not contradict the concept of tawakkul. Asking once and twice and several times, there is nothing wrong with that. When you ask people whom you assume that they can uh, help. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala adv uh, admired Al-Ansar in the Quran. Check out Surah Al-Hashr for helping Al-Muhajireen. And there are some people who are helpless. Maybe because of disability, not able, not able to work. Or you need some body to assist you to get a job or to start off a business or whatever so you can ask once or twice and, and, and three times there is no limit for how many you ask there is no uh, restriction uh, in this respect um, also the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was told in the Quran about those who have been cursed by Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala not only that you do not help others, rather they prevent others from helping those who are in need. So we have to give, we have to assist, we have to help. The hadith says, The upper hand is better than the lower hand. And begin with the one who is under your guardianship. When he said al yadul ulya khayrun min al yad sufla he said also uh, the hadith says al mu'min al qawi khayrun min al mu'min al da'if wa fi kulli khayr sometimes allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blessed you with means and others are being tested with lack of means so those who have should assist those who do not have whenever i am a person who puts his trust in allah subhanahu wa ta'ala truly and does the true tawakkul uh, I try to find the means to earn it or to achieve it lawfully. While I know for certain that Allah the Almighty will help me out, will assist me to achieve my goal or to get my provision. So there is no conflict in this respect.